Happy Hour Play Theater in Hollywood, the center of the universe. Opening night here in LA for Fences. Please welcome to the stage, to the theater, actually, the wife of August Wilson. Yes, Constanza Wilson, ladies and gentlemen. Getting a breakthrough, breakthrough performance in Fences, Javon Adepo. Ladies and gentlemen, two-time Oscar winner, Denzel Washington! Fellowship, 
and I was that new person that was there, so I was just hoping they would like me. What was your first scene that you filmed? The first scene that I filmed was when um, when Rose is sitting in the kitchen after her and and, uh, and Troy get into it and I come through after ball practice and then they told me love on my mom, which I do very well in life. So and that's your first scene. That's a hell of a way to break in. It's a, it's a smooth transition. At least I had a couple of days to brace myself for, for, the, uh, for the, the song, you know, the, the first big single. When, when, you're, when, you're doing, <laughs> when you're doing a film like this, based on a, a state play from August Wilson, and the rhythm is going, do you feel the, the, the sort of, I guess, instinct as an actor to improvise from there, or is it just like, no, we are staying true to his words? You can't improvise Shakespeare. You don't. August Wilson is American Shakespeare. Yeah. You don't improvise Shakespeare. You know, the, the, the line is, my lord, they're coming. The line is, my lord, they're coming. <laughs> Not my lord, I got a feeling they might be on their way. <laughs> <laughs> right? So, we, we, I purposely what hard to stay true to what he wrote. If there's twenty five if there's twenty five thousand words in this screenplay, twenty four thousand nine hundred and ninety six of them are always Wilson's. I added the commissioner will see you now. <laughs> or something like that. So we I wanted to lead with August and these tremendous performances. Viola Davis is a monster. Stephen Henderson, just, I, I call him the bass player. He doesn't miss anything. He's down there just keeping the rhythm. And people may have forgotten about Michael T. Williamson. He's great. But he's great. That's who he plays games. And, and, uh, so. uh, Viola Davis, the great Viola Davis. Oh my goodness. Um, wow. Yes. Many times as you, you perform with her, the stage play, of course, working with her on Antoine Fisher, your first movie as a director, uh, was there, were there any moments that still, while you're filming this movie, where you still just had to take a step back and go, my goodness, she just is amazing? Well, the, really, the, 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 not the best part of it, but that, that actually came for me when Troy was already gone. Because in the play, once he's gone, trying to get away. Once he's gone, I'm in the dressing room, I in my knees. So I didn't watch, I didn't watch each night the rest of the play when Raynell is there and, and on. And I've watched it a couple times, but I didn't watch it that much. So now I'm, I, I'm concentrating on, on, on what they're doing and, and how they're doing it. And uh, you know, it just, it was just beautiful to watch. It, 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 she just gives a, such a multi-layered performance and a powerful performance and it's amazing. And Onto this piece of it, that a man wrote one of the most powerful monologues for a woman about what a man did to her. <laughs> you know, when she goes into, you know, I've been standing right there with you. And I want to ask. I was going to ask you anyway about Rose, about like what made her just one of all the best women that you wrote. But that just that's a perfect say into that because. Of yeah. Well. Um, I think that August wanted to give voice to the people that um, he grew up with. Um, I, there were several men in his life that uh, that spoke to August about masculinity. But uh, I think that with every woman character that August writes, he pays homage to his mother, uh, an African-American woman who uh, had six children, um, August said a song would escape her sometimes parched mouth, and the contents of her pantry were worthy of art. So, uh, you know, that kind of elevation of, of uh, the human life, the humanity behind these characters are uh, the things that he so succeeds at, both women and men.